Hi everybody, Belover911 here with my tutorials for RPG Maker XP. So right now I'm going to be showing you changing gold items, weapon, and armor. Really basic. Um, for your event, you click on change gold, and you can either increase or decrease the amount that you want to have. So let's say we have our friend Bob here saying let's say he's in front of a toll bridge and he says you must pay me 50 gold to pass okay we go show choice one is OK, choice two is no, choice two is disallow. So when you say OK, you will decrease your gold by 50. Copy and paste. Go ahead and start off with 50 gold, if I can find out where to do that. Weapons armor. Well, we'll just make a little event for it. Try a little process. Change gold, increase it to 50. Now, if you don't turn this event off, it will keep adding 50, and it will never stop. Almost like a loop. Don't ask me why it does that. But, so, control self switch A on, new event, self switch A, and there's nothing on the page. So. It'll start me off with 50 gold. You can see down in the corner here, 50 gold. Talk to him. Uh-oh, it's not letting me talk to him. Maybe that's the problem. Okay. Now that his second page is gone, talk to him again. Okay, you must pay me 50 gold to pass. Say no, nothing happens. You can see I still have my 50 gold. Talk to him again. You must pay me 50 gold to pass. Say okay. You can see down at the bottom here, I don't have any gold left. That's because it's already decreased. So. It doesn't matter what you say now, you don't have any gold, so... What you can do with this is, say, let's create a new event. Conditional branch. If... Gold is zero or less Where's his graphic? Soldier. Hmm. Come on, Bob, where are you? There you go. Okay. So we'll make a little switch here called No Gold. And we'll make it say. You don't have enough gold. Say okay. So 
we'll say since you need 50 let's say you have 49 gold or less so if you have 49 or less gold turn no gold on and when no gold is on he will say you don't have enough gold so instead of making this an automatic 50 gold action trigger we'll make a little chest and we'll make it say you received 50 gold so talk to him I don't have any gold so I talk to him you must pay me 50 gold to pass uh oh I didn't make this parallel process this has to be automatic okay you don't have enough gold. So I don't have any gold. Talk to him, you don't have enough gold. So I go over to the chest. You receive fifty gold. And my fifty gold is there now. Talk to him. You don't have enough gold. Why is it doing that? Oh, I know why. Or else, okay. So we'll turn no gold. So uh, switches. Turn no gold off. And when no gold is off, it will automatically go back to page one. So this is what I want now. I'm certain this will work. Talk to him. I don't have any gold. It says you don't have enough gold. Go to the chest. You've received 50 gold. You can see I have 50 gold now. I'll go back and talk to him. You must pay me 50 gold to pass. If you say no, you still have the 50 gold. It wasn't moved anywhere. You must pay me 50 gold to pass. You say okay, and now the gold's gone. Now that you don't have enough, you talk to him again. He says you don't have enough gold. So there you go. There's my gold tutorial. It's pretty much the same for items. Any item that you have, you can give it to them however many you want, or decrease however many you want, or by a variable. Variables have different amounts. So, um, Weapons are the same. Give a weapon or take it away or buy variable amount. Same with armor. So that's pretty much basic. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you'll join me in others. See you then.